It's time for Tech Time with Timmy. Hello, welcome to Tech Time with Timmy. In this video, Timmy's going to be talking about how to delete files off your Chromebook. So, if you have a Chromebook and you've got files on it that you want to delete, in this video, Timmy's going to show you how. So, when you're on your Chromebook and you're in the Files app, if you don't know how to get to the Files app, just click down here and then click on this arrow and the Files app will be somewhere here. There it is. But once you're in the Files app, you just need to choose the file you want to delete and then there'll be a delete button. So if you wanted to delete this music file, you can just click on it like that so that it looks selected. Don't double click on it so that it opens, just single click on it so that it looks selected. And then you'll see this trash can up here. So if you just click on that, it will say, are you sure you want to delete the name of the file? And you can just click on delete and the file will be gone. So now that file is completely gone from your Chromebook. So that's all there is to it. But if there are some files on your Chromebook that you just can't seem to delete, you click on them and you just don't see a delete button anywhere. That may be for a few different reasons. So Timmy's going to show you what you can do about that now. So one of the reasons is if you're in a zip folder and you're looking at the files in here, when you go into zip folders, it says read only, so you can't actually make any changes inside the zip folder. You would have to move all the files out of the zip folder before you can delete them. So if you click on the icon of each one so that they all become selected and move them all into your downloads folder, or it doesn't have to be downloads, it can be any other folder on your Chromebook, then you can click on this button to get rid of the zip folder. You'll see all your files that were in the zip folder are now in your downloads folder or wherever you moved them to. So you can just delete the zip folder now by doing the thing to me showed you before. And now you can delete any of the files you want to delete. So if you don't want this penguin, you can just click on it and delete it. And if you wanted these two files to be back inside the zip folder, you could just select them both like this and right click on them and click on zip selection and they would zip back up. But that means the file you want it deleted is now gone. So that's what you do if it's in a zip folder, but there's also another reason you might not be able to delete your files. So if you're in any of these images or recent or audio folders up here, then you, you'll notice that they also say read only up the top here. So you can edit or change or delete the files in here, but the files aren't actually stored in here. They're stored somewhere else on your Chromebook or in your Google Drive. And it's just showing you them here in a nice order if you're looking to find one of them. So for example, if you wanted to delete nice picture here that's called nice picture, you would need to remember the name of nice picture. So remember it's nice picture. And then you'll need to go and search on your Chromebook to try and find it. So if you look at Google Drive first, because it's most likely going to be on Google Drive, you can then click on the search button in Google Drive and type nice picture because that's what it was called. Or just type whatever your file is named and then press on enter and it will show you all the files in your Google Drive that are called nice pictures. So you see this nice picture here and when you're in the search you can choose it and you can delete it. So that's one way or if it doesn't show up here in the search of Google Drive then you'll probably want to just go on to my files and search for it here because any file that's actually saved on your Chromebook will be under my files. But if it's in Google Drive and just showing up on your Chromebook, it'll be under Google Drive. So you can search for it using these two different folders, or you can click around and try to find the file if you think you might know where else it might be, and then delete it using the method to me showed at the start of this video. So that's really cool. And that's really all there is to deleting files from your Chromebook. So hopefully you found this helpful. And if you found value in this video, please click on the thumbs up button down below. And if you want to see more videos like this, click on the subscribe button down below and click on the little bell icon next to the subscribe button to be notified every time Timmy makes a new video. So that's really cool. And that'll be the end of this episode of Tech Time with Timmy.